with intercessor, may you be encouraged today because together we are creating hundreds of prayer meetings every single day. It's just amazing what is going on. Some people could not pray one time a week and now they are praying every single day of the week. It is fantastic. Today I want to talk about why we need new structures and this is specifically today to leaders. Thank you leaders for what you are doing, planting groups, maintaining groups, encouraging groups. And why do we need new structures? I received a proposal recently to make a new site so that we can host more groups because we are running out of space in our current site and it's difficult to find a group among 170 different groups a day. Okay, so it shows as another sign that we need new structures. Matthew chapter 9 verse 17 says, Also, people never poured new wine into old leather bags, otherwise the bags will break. The wine will spill and the wine bags will be ruined. But people always pour new wine into new bags. Then both will continue to be good. This is an excellent example that you cannot continue to have the same structures and try something new from the Lord. My friend, I'm going to encourage to plan new groups, to make goals bigger for this year, to ask the Lord how to, how you can coordinate a whole network of groups because the people that are coming cannot be contained in one little group. The same is for our, our network. Please help me, help us financially because we urgently need to begin to prepare. This is going to take months of work, but we need to prepare a new system so that when new people come to our site, they can easily and quickly find a group for them. We need new structures. We need new wineskins. Will you help us? Let's work together on this. Let this be a year of great and tremendous faith and new thinking and new structures. God bless you.